Hi everybody, it is Sid. And today I'm doing a kind of makeup tutorial, but not really. Just kind of how I do my makeup, which is really basic. I'm not a beauty guru at all, and <laughs> I'm also very sick today. I've already primed my face because I did that, and then I was just like, no, I don't like that run, and, and, and I don't want to have to redo it. I have sparkles on my face because there's sparkles on my desk. <sighs> Shouldn't have said that. <clears throat> okay, so let's get right into it. And voiceover, take over. So today we're starting out with my primer. It's Caress something. It's, it's really sweet. It smells like roses, and that's always good. And I'm using Urban Decay Naked Foundation in the share, shade Fair because I am pale. Oh, I, oh, oh, oh gosh, <laughs> I'm good. And I'm using my Tarte foundation brush and I, I love it. It's not focusing for some weird reason and that is not my fault. So I do about two pumps of my Naked foundation and I just spread that all over my face with my, my Tarte brush. Wow, what am I looking, okay. So I just apply that to my face. It's very full coverage but I also am very used to having very little foundation, so I like make that full coverage not as full coverage by like spreading it out. So I guess that's not a good thing, but you know, I do it. I do that on my eyelids too because I don't trust my eyeshadow and stuff and my eye primer to completely 100%. Oh my gosh, my dog is running in the background um, to cover up all the veins and stuff. So wow, I spent a long time on that. Okay, and my dog just dropped the bottle. That's good. So I just apply that all over my face holes. And um, yeah, it is 100% my shade. And <laughs> oh my gosh, Mac, be chill. <laughs> Next up, I just take a beauty blender and I blend all of that together so that I don't have streakiness on my face because, you know, no one loves that. And I take the excess um, foundation from the back of my hand and I put it on my beauty blender and I just cover up anything else. <sighs> and I smile at the camera and crack my neck. Oh my gosh, that popped a lot. Next up, I take my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I apply that to my acne and also to my T-zone to highlight the midpoints of my face, but also that kind of defeats the purpose because there's just random dots on my face with highlight, I guess. My eyebrow thing, eyebrow pencil by IT, that was very close and it didn't focus. Ignore that. <laughs> and, okay, so I just do my eyebrows, but I'm not very good at it. So I try to do my eyebrows, but it never really works. Next up, I take, take my air sun, I don't know how to pronounce it, and don't judge me if I become Flashback Mary in the middle of this, and my Laura Geller baking brush, but if I become Flashback Mary in the middle of this, as you can see, wiping off the excess powder, I have squeaky hands, and now I grab my Bare Minerals brush, it used to be a conceal and blend brush, but I kind of accidentally broke off the conceal part. And I'm using a little sample kit that I got from Ulta. So I take my illuminator and I just apply that to my T-zone. And pretty much in the focal points of my face so that I look more 3D and not like a painting. I take a contour brush. I honestly don't know where it's from, but I just apply bronzer to my cheekbone to make me look sister snatched I take a Laura Geller no no that's a bare minerals brush actually no bare minerals blush brush saying that and I take a Laura Geller blush that is very old because I use it all the time so I just take that and I put it on my cheeks where you put blush Next up, I, this is another sample thing. Um, they're really, it's really cute. It's an Ulta palette, and it's probably one of my favorites. And I'll look around for a brush. I use three different It brushes. 
um, and one tart brush, but I'm not sure if I used that in this look specifically. Um, yeah, they look like pencils, so like if I get caught in class doing my makeup, I could just like pretend to be writing down stuff. But. And I dip into the shade Pin Up Girl, and I just apply that to my crease and to my lid. It is a beautiful shade. <laughs> And then I dip into the shade plus, nope, wait, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm showing what shade I just dipped into. I dipped into Pin Up Girl, and now I'm dipping into Plum Pop, which is beautiful. It's like a nice purple color, and I like it a lot. And I just apply that to my crease and look fabulous in the process. And I am wiping off the fallout. Relatable, am I right? Ladies and gentlemen, and all in between. Then I dip into Autumn Spice, and I apply that to my lid and my inner corner. As I said, not a beauty guru here, I'm just a little baby child doing makeup because she barely knows how to. And now that I'm done with my eyes, well, my eyeshadow, I'm going to dip, not dip, I'm going to use some mascara. It is, I don't really care about, like, all the fancy, like, Sephora and Ulta and MAC foundations. I mean, not foundations. Oh, my gosh. Foundation is life. Mascaras. Um, because it's just, like, it, it's mascara. So I'm just using, I'm pretty sure... It is Maybelline. Next up I get, I think it's CoverGirl. It's a brown, I mean not brown, orange thing. So I'm 99.99% .99 sure that it's CoverGirl. Next up I take my L'Oreal um, Carbon Black. I'm doing this from memory actually. Carbon Black um, Voluminizing. Next. I take my color cover FX um, setting spray and I spray my face like a boss and then I realize that I didn't put on lipstick. So then I put on the Ulta lipstick. It's an Ulta lipstick. I bought a lot of Ulta products. I <sighs> Yeah. It's it's a nice nude color. So now that I look beautiful, I'm gonna leave. Okay, psych, I'm actually still here. Uh, I kind of forgot to put highlight on, so I'm just using my Benefit Cosmetics. It's a little sample thing too. What is up with me and samples? But it's a Benefit Cosmetics highlight and it's a liquid highlight. I don't use this very often because it's very hard to, but I have seemed to have lost my normal highlighter so so if I look ridiculous after this that that is why and it is not my fault so I just apply that to my cupid's bow my nose my brow bone and my cheekbones like a normal human being and I try to use a small bl beauty blender and then I'm like oh my gosh this isn't blending so you know what I'm just gonna use my finger it, it's gonna happen anytime now okay just chill <laughs> So then I'm just like, what the heck is happening? Why is this not bending? Ah, da, 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 da. Exactly like that. <laughs> so as you can see, I'm just using my finger to smudge. And then I accidentally do smudge my makeup. And I look like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Well, everybody, I hope you enjoyed that makeup tutorial. And if you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Because I like... Potatoes in the springtime. I wasn't sure if I was going to do like a makeup tutorial or a just like, hey, I do this. It's cool. Um, so I kind of told you guys what I do, but like also it's not really step by step, you know? Yeah. <laughs> well, and Hoosies, um, I hope you all enjoyed that. And make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I'm holding Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up. 
and leave a comment down below if you want to just whatever's on your mind um <laughs> and i will see you guys in the next one bye love you bye.